too. I mean, we, it seems to be in layers. Yeah, it, it was a, a situation like that. I, the light is, of course, important, as is composition, but preparation as well. I've been to Nakuru in Kenya a few times. And you need a lot of circumstances to make this happen. It's got to rain the night before. The rain's got to stop by a certain time. The 1,600 meters of altitude have got to be allowed to kick in, so it's got to be cold. And then, I think, critical, you've got to gamble. Now, I know uh, from studying this area that hyenas generally come along the shoreline to try and grab the infirm and the old or the, the very young flamingos. And I thought, I'm not actually going to try and photograph that because I've seen it before. If I go the other side looking into the sun, hopefully they'll put enough up into the sky and it was just a question of being there. Now, there's luck as well. I mean, did you honestly think I picked those three? Oh, there they are. That's the one I've been waiting for. No, no. There were a few other frames as well. Yeah, there was a few. Yes, we'll keep it into double figures just, I think. It it was just a moment. It's quite exceptional, isn't it? It is. It's fabulous. And the the monochromatic rendering, I think, is particularly Monochromatic rendering, that's what I thought. (laughs) Backlighting isn't easy. It's It's difficult to expose it correctly. And it's difficult to uh, to master uh, the, the the kind of feel of it uh, that you have done here. The three flamingos are very important, without a doubt. That's what makes it such. How long did it take you from start to finish to get this shot? Oh no, it's not a question. The actual moment lasted. There was, I suppose conditions like that for about seven or eight minutes and then of course the heat builds yes. up you're close okay. to the equator and and the mist is gone and i'm with you on techniques i mean really i'm all about the the image uh, and the photograph rather than all the technical qualities yeah. people talk about histograms i just about know the difference between an f-stop and a bus stop but not much more <laughs> uh, and so, so to me it's just about the photograph yeah. get do the graft and if you do the graft you can sometimes get the craft uh, out of it brilliant well you're from the uk marcel is from the netherlands I'm now going to tell who is from Germany. So tell us about your photograph. 